Hey guys, it's John, and today I wanted to show you something pretty cool. Uh, this is my lava bridge. This is the thing I've been sort of building up as time went on. Uh, at first, it was just a pretty boring bridge where you hit one lever, it came up, and you hit it again, it went down. And then we added to it, we added a delay onto the repeaters at the bottom down here, which meant the pistons came up in a sort of pattern, as you can see. And then we added a X or gate, which allows us to add another lever on the other side, like that. And then we added a deactivating system, so when we pressed a button this piston came down deactivating the redstone which would deactivate the levers, which mean we wouldn't be able to use them anymore. They wouldn't work. And then now we're going to be adding a combination lock to the deactivating system. So watch that, that piston there. If I hit lock, it will lock the levers, which means we can't, they don't work anymore. And there is one on the other side. And then we need to hit do the combination lock to unlock it. So uh, let's say we put in one, three, five. Unlock. Nothing happened. Uh, hmm. Five, four, five, six. Nothing happened. Um, let's try. Three, five, two, one, and six. Nope, still doesn't work. So the real combination is two, three, five. So we put in two, three, five, hit it, it unlocks, and then we can use it. And then we could add another one of these on the other side. So we can unlock it, walk across. Over here, lower it again, and then we can lock it again, hitting a button. So then we could unlock it again, walk across, hit that, and then we could lock it like that. So that's about it, really. Uh, if you guys wanted a tutorial, I guess I could do that. It's not particularly hard, it's just an AND gate and a uh, latch using. Uh, various some torches and just yeah so it's pretty easy I could do a tutorial if you guys don't really know if you're not really following what's happening but uh, yeah that's about it and I shall see you guys later